Hello ladies and gents, Rogue here and welcome to Normal One Films and like I said you guys in the update this week we are going to be starting the iMovie tutorial which is this, this is going to be the new iMovie, I'm going to open up right here show you guys iMovie right here and uh, yeah that's my face on right here but I'm going to show you guys first iMovie, iMovie 10.0 this is the newest version it's got the new purplish bluish uh, emblem looking but as soon as you launch it, this is going to be the first episode. It's going to be just Tech with Throw episode, but I'm going to start an entire new series. But as soon as you launch it, it's going to be just very similar setup like this here that I have here. You're going to see your libraries, just like in the old iMovie. You're going to see your libraries right here on this left-hand side. Yeah, But you're normally you're actually in the original iMovie. You saw them right down here, your libraries. And then now you'll have all the way down here, you'll have a content library. You're which consists of your transitions, titles, maps, and iTunes, which normally on the original iMovie was right on this side here. So, and then you had your projects, which were, I mean, your time, I mean, not your timeline, your timeline was up here. And, uh, well, it depends how you had your setup. Mine was set up with my timeline up here, and my actual project projects were down here. So, what I'm gonna do to start off, I'm gonna show you guys, guide you through some of these things, and this is like import your movies. You can actually simply drag and drop whatever you want to import now into the event that you want to drag and drop it into. But for this reason, I'm not gonna do that right now. I'm not gonna do anything too hard, and then you can actually view your rejected, favorited clips, like depending how you bookmarked them and how you uh, imported them and how you actually selected. It. Like you can click on a film and hit right click and then like or just hit the delete button it will move it to your rejected clips so then you can go to, to your rejected clips on here and uh, fully remove it from your computer and move it to the trash can other than that I'm gonna, gonna change some settings here and you guys can watch um, I'm gonna show you what I'm gonna do as well just because I wanna revert it back to the layout that I'm used to and I'm familiar with and we're gonna go on from there so first thing off is I'm gonna go up to here to window and I'm gonna go to, to swap project in the event meaning it's gonna swap this box here with this box here because I prefer my timeline being up here I'm just I'm just used to it and I'm, I'm yeah so here you are now it's all set up now that's the way I want my projects are done here so it looks a little more familiar to me now next thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna resize this up here this basically changes the size of your clip that way it's not like super huge and you have to like scroll back a bunch and try to find what you're looking for so I have it extra, I have it extra small because then I can actually just go through and see it myself and I can edit it through small not not going through a bunch of footage other than that another thing I'm gonna change is down here I'm gonna go down here and I'm gonna change this clip size to really small because when you upload import the videos in here into this box here when there are videos here like I'll show you right here there's videos here instead of them being extremely huge to go through sometimes people like that I like it really small and compact that way I can keep it all in one place and I can work around it that way and then I'm gonna keep it at 10 seconds I believe I like to have it at let's see yeah five seconds actually so yeah we're gonna keep it up five seconds and there you are there's that side movie theater mode don't worry about that right now just work concentrating on library and I'll show you guys uh, more tutorials coming in after um, I'm gonna have another tutorial up for you guys tomorrow about iMovie so and also I'll show you what these do here these are your new uh, editing tools like change and color enhancements and additional tools which I'll show you go over in the tutorials ahead thank you guys for watching this first episode First, and uh, I believe like 17th episode of Tech with Row. And catch you guys in the series later.